Hi, Virgos. Um, Virgos, this is a reading from yesterday. I did a reading. Oh, a bird just flew past my window. Wow, that's so beautiful. It was a little bitty baby bird. It just flew past my window again. That's a sign, a message. Ancestor spirit guides, a loved one saying hello to me. Or oh, this could be someone that's trying to tell me, tell you hello. Someone could have passed away or something like that. Okay, anyway, gosh. Okay, Virgo, I did y'all reading yesterday. For some reason, my phone had freeze. It froze. And it's kind of messed up right now. So I have to do it on my, on this phone. But let me get this done real quick because I have to, you know, a lot of things I got to do. All right, Virgo, so this reading is for July 21st, July 22nd, July 23rd. 2023, right? Okay. So the first card, I just want to say you could be dealing with a water sign as well. Okay. So Virgo, the first card I have is two of swords. Air sign. Generally with Aquarius or Aquarius. You could be dealing with Aquarius. This is someone that's that's close off to you. They protecting themselves. They feel like they need to guard themselves, to protect their feelings or something from you. I don't know what you've done to this person, what you did to this person, but the two of swords, this is an air sign that's feeling hurt, betrayed by you. Okay, this person's feeling hurt, okay? This person's feeling like, I don't know, they just to themselves. They feel like they just need to protect themselves, guard themselves. Um, a peace of mind. It's like this person is thinking to themselves, they need a peace of mind to themselves, they need peace and harmony, they want peace and harmony, okay and so we have a knight of pentacles, Virgo so this is you going towards this two of swords so you could be going towards this air sign, alright trying to offer them something, give them something, it could be food, money drugs, drinks it could be business and pleasure I don't know, maybe you're trying to give this person some money, but this person is refusing you. They're refusing to take it because it's, I don't know, they refusing to accept anything from you. Maybe this person know what you are. Maybe this person listen to the intuition about you. Maybe this person know what you're up to, okay? So maybe you did this before. Maybe you played this little manipulation game with this person before. And they catch on to it. They caught on to it. They see you for who you really are or who you really is or whatsoever. But this somebody, I don't know, you're trying to manipulate this air sign, Virgo. I have to keep it real. You're trying to manipulate this person. You're trying to break from this person. You're trying to, like, um, persuade this person. You're trying to do something. You're trying to make this person give in to you. And this person's not giving in. So you're trying to buy love, sex, you're trying to buy your way in, like you're trying to, you're trying to shut this person's mouth up. You don't want this person to do something. It's like you paying this person to be quiet, to be quiet about something. It's like you paying this person because you know you're guilty. Anyway, let's move the fuck on. I have four swords. <laughs> I have the four swords, right, right? So, I don't know, like I said, you could be paying this person, you want sex. I don't know if this is like a codependency relationship where y'all business and pleasure, okay? So, you want to have sex with this person. You want to pay this person for sex, okay? It, uh, it seems to me this for source, this person could be stressed out, depressed, worrying, this person could be focused on themselves, doing some healing, nurturing to themselves. It's like somebody is, they could be hiding from you. They could be like ignoring you. Maybe they don't want to be bothered with you. Okay. But I feel like you're trying to buy sex. You, either you're getting this person high off drugs or maybe this person went along with it. Maybe they decided to go along with you or, like the four swords is sick, illness, stress, depression, meditating, praying, 
healing in jail. Um, yeah, someone could be like hiding from you. Maybe they don't want to be bothered with you. Maybe this person is stressed out. Maybe this person needs peace, like rest. It's I feel like you're trying to have sex with this person. This could be a Libra. You could be dealing with a Libra as well. It could be a Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, or a Libra, or air sign. But this could be an air sign that you're messing around with. Or like I said, that you're um, paying for someone. You're paying for sex. You're buying sex. Anyway, we have the Six of Pentacles. Let me move fast. We have the Six of Pentacles. All right, so you paying this person. I don't know if you're tricking off. I don't know if you're a pimp, Virgo. What, whatever you doing, it's like you making somebody bad for you. You want somebody to bad for you. Like somebody giving somebody head or a blowjob. Like somebody's paying someone like to be quiet about something. Uh, some shit. It's like sex is involved. It's money. It's like you want this air sign to beg you get on your knee, get on their knees. It's like somebody have to have sex with you before you give them money. Is this is to me? This is abuse. Someone could be abusing someone. It's like somebody is not. Hmm. <sighs> like you using someone. I hate to say that, but it, you using someone, Virgo. Like, I don't know if this person's missing you. This Libra could be missing you. Someone's missing you. Someone needs help. Someone's sick. Someone could be on drugs bad. All right. Someone's being taken advantage of. Okay. This is, I'm not going to go from there. Like you're taking advantage of someone. You stressing someone out, you giving someone drugs. It's like, I don't like I said, I don't know if you're a pimp or someone's out here on this. Let me shut the fuck up because this is pissing me off, period. Two of swords, we have the um that hangman. So this air sign could be putting you on hold, putting things off. Maybe this person don't trust you, they don't want to deal with you. Like somebody needs a peace of mind to themselves, someone's protecting themselves from you. They're protecting their feelings from you. Like someone feels like this relationship is not working, so they push it on hold. Like someone's called, like someone's putting something on hold. Blockages, delays. This is somebody that they don't want to deal with you. Okay. So this person could be doing this on purpose. Yeah, this person's putting their love on hold for you. They, it's like they, they need to find peace within themselves. Okay, this air sign needs to find peace. This person is listening to their intuition. It's something about you. You making this person feel, I don't know. This person needs, like this person's putting this, putting things on hold, blockages, delays. This person's putting a relationship on hold. Okay, this is somebody that's protecting itself. They feel like they need to guard itself. Okay. That somebody's tired of the abuse. It's like somebody's putting something on hold with you. Like you, you're not treating this person fair or right. Like, somebody's like, fuck that. They're not going to keep having sex with you, okay, for money. So, I don't know if you're trying to break, like, you're trying to manipulate, you're trying to stop someone from getting something from you, like, taking you to court for something. So, this person realized what you're trying to do to them. That's why they like, you know what, this person, this, somebody knows you're trying to use them. Anyway, the Knight of Pentacles, we have the Queen of Pentacles. Okay. So you can be going towards another earth sign. This person can be minding their business, focus on themselves. 
they unbother, they might be thinking about you. Or this can be you. You can be the queen of pentacles, full moon. I don't know, you just want to be by yourself or you feel sad or lonely or some shit. You feeling hurt. Or maybe you need to focus on yourself, your money, your porn or something. Maybe you need to focus on healing. Like I said, this can be another earth sign that feel hurt by you, betrayed by you, torn by you. And this person could be focused on themselves. This person's unbothered. They don't want to deal with you. They could be ignoring you as well. Or like I said, you can be the queen of pentacles. You feel alone. You feel sad. You wonder why this person don't want to fuck with you. Okay? And the four swords is a magician. Someone could be doing spell work on the air sign. Someone could be trying to control someone with spell work. I don't know if someone's trying to hypnotize someone. Uh, Virgo, this is you, the magician. So I don't know if you're doing sex magic on this air sign. you controlling this person with spell work. This person could be feeling sick, tired, and drained or something. It's because you're doing spell work. You do some black magic, juju, voodoo, voodoo. Like somebody's under a spell. You're trying to put someone under a spell, an air sign. I don't know if this air sign is feeling sick, drained, tired, stressed out, depressed. Um, I said depressed. Depressed. Having anxiety, scared, or nervous. This shit is weird. This is this is so weird. This is so wrong. Ask spirit, the six of pentacles is the page of wands. So this is a fire sign coming towards you. Like I said, I don't know if you a pimp or what, but this fire sign coming towards you. Maybe this person needs your help, your support, some type of assistance for you. I don't know if you paying this person to dance, to strip. So it's a fire sign. This person could be dancing on a pole. I don't know if you paying this person money. You at a stripper club or something. I'm seeing a fire sign. This could be a friend of me, enemy. This could be someone that you used to deal with. This is someone that could have betrayed you, deceived you. Now they need your help in some kind of way. So maybe this person, I don't know, is a stripper or somebody dancing on a pole. You throwing money at them or some shit like that. But somebody needs your help. This is a fire sign. Like I said, they see that you're supporting somebody else or something that you pay some money or something. This person needs your help. Like I said, they could have betrayed you, deceived you in some kind of way. Now they're coming back because they need your support. They need your help. They need to borrow some money or some shit like that. Okay. I asked Spirit, what was the hangman? Gave me justice. So this person wants justice. This air sign wants justice. Somebody could be taking you to court. Like somebody wants to be treated fair. So whatever you've been trying to do, earth sign, Virgo, this person knows that you've been lying, cheating them, using them like a roll of tissue. So they said, fuck that. All right, you're not going to breadcrumb them anymore. We're not going to play games with you anymore. If you don't want to give them their money, they're going to take your ass to court and get their money. Justice. Like somebody's taking justice in their own hands or they're going to take you to court. <laughs> okay, so this is somebody want justice. It could be child support, inheritance, lawsuit, some type of money, a business you and this person is into and involved with or whatever. Uh, I spirit, what, what's the <laughs> queen of pentacles? They gave me seven pentacles. So this could be you. Virgo, thinking to yourself, something is going on with you, Virgo. It's something that's in your life is making you behave and act this way, to treat people this way or treat this person this way. You're thinking like, damn, what did I do? What did I do? Uh, you know you're in the wrong about something, all right? You need to get your life together. Somebody need to get their life together. Somebody need to, I don't know, something about scheming and scamming trying to get over people trying to use a person trying to like abuse a person like it's something that you need to fix you have to get a, a good hard think to yourself think real hard it's you 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 saying is it me or is it this it's you virgo okay you hurry somebody and you plotting planning how to get them how to get to them how to approach them 
how to fool them again, how to trick them again, how to scam them again. Or this could be you. You you working on you need to work on yourself. Something that you're doing is like the is negative. Something that you're doing is making you behave a certain way, act a certain way, do negative things. So you could be thinking what needs to be done. Your attitude, your personality, the way you carry yourself, present yourself, the way you treat people. You like you, it's like you know you wrong. It's like you know you've been doing wrong. It's like you know you've been doing wrong to a certain person. Or you, it's like, so I don't know if you're hiding money, you're being selfish, you're lying about money, somebody could be stealing money. Saving money, hey, that's your business. I'm just saying like, Something that you need to work on. Like I said, something you need to, maybe it's your self-esteem, your insecurity. Something you need to work on. Fix. Okay, so I asked Google was the magician. They gave me King of Wands. I got a fire sign that's watching me. This could be a private investigator, parole officer, or undercover cop, supervisor, manager, um, your boss, uh, a uh, secret admirer, a family, an enemy, but someone is watching you. Okay? Like, someone could be a witch and a warlock, a high priestess, a high priest. Someone is, like, somebody knows something about you, Virgo. Like, somebody's watching you, or this could be you. Okay, but someone is watching you, a fire sign. I don't know if the person's obsessed with you. But someone knows you up to something. Someone knows you doing something. And somebody got their eyes on you. They're suspicious about you. I don't know what's going on with you. But anyway, let's move on. Like, like somebody knows that you doing some type of spell work on them, something like magician, like somebody knows that you into the coat, into the cover. The coat is like, you know, yeah, something, something, someone's doing, and someone knows something. Anyway, I asked it, what was the page of wands? Okay, they gave me strength card. So this fire sign is that somebody don't like you. They don't like you. They want to get to you. They want to, it's like this person is angry, very aggressive towards you. Spirit is holding this person back from you. They spirit guys could be holding them back from you as well. But spirit is telling this person that they're keeping this fire sign away from you. Because this fire sign could be very dangerous. Or this could be you. You never know. But this fire sign could be very dangerous. This, this is somebody could be obsessed with you, jealous of you, or you did something to them, you betrayed them in some kind of way, hurt them in some kind of way. I'm like, somebody's mad because maybe because you don't want to be bothered with them anymore. Maybe you turned this person down. Or maybe you rejected this person. I don't know. Somebody feels like you owe them something. Maybe you do, maybe you don't. Maybe you do, maybe you don't. And I asked Spirit, what was the strength card? He gave me the nine of wands. So these could be some people, a group of people, or a fire sign. Yeah, a fire sign, a group of people. It could be a Sagittarius as well. But somebody envies you. So these people feel hurt by you, burdened by you, betrayed, backstabbed, deceived. Like these people, I don't know what you've done to this fire sign or these people, but they seem to have some type of issues with you. They seem to be irritated by you. They seem to be bothered. They seem to be envied, threatened, jealous of you. I don't know what you did. Maybe you owe this, maybe you owe this fire sign some money or these people. I know someone feels played and used by you. These people have mental illness, mental issues. This fire sign is Sagittarius or a group of people. 
Like someone feels scarred, damaged. I don't know what you did, Virgo. What did you do? You could be spreading me as your enemies. You could be people in your family, so-called friends, people that you grew with, people that you let go of. That's some shit. Last bit was the King of Wands. He gave me the Ace of Pentacles. So somebody know that you're getting some money, some type of success, something that's coming in for you. A lottery win, inheritance, lawsuit, something, a lump of sum of money, your success, your career. Like somebody's watching you. Somebody knows something about you. Like somebody knows you get money. This could be a someone that you hang around, around you, a family member, a boss, a friend of enemy. But somebody's watching you because you're getting this ace of pentacles. Something that you're getting. Somebody, I don't know if this person wants to rob you, stick you up, or I don't know if this person's jealous of you, envy of you. But somebody's watching you. Your reading is fucking, it's, um, anyway. Last spirit, what was the seven of pentacles? So like I said, Virgo, something that you're doing, you know you're doing something wrong because you're feeling guilty. It's like you're thinking like, damn, I know I'm wrong. Damn, I know I've been mistreating people. I know I've been mistreating this person. I, something that you stole took a something. I don't know. But you know you're doing wrong. Something that you know you, you're thinking about it. You're like, is it me? Is it me? It, it, I know it, it's like you're in denial about something. So I asked if it was the uh, Seven of Pentacles. They gave me Page of Cups. So this could be a young water sign, a cancer coming towards you. Okay, maybe they want to offer you some type of sympathy or something. Maybe this person, I don't know, see that you're hurt or you're going through something. Somebody that you're addicted to, you, you're having a hard time staying away from. Or something. You're having a hard time build, staying away from someone or getting away from, I don't know, something. It's a water sign. So somebody's coming towards you. Mm, they see that you, I don't know, you're feeling some kind of way. And they want to offer a cup. They want to be your friend, offer you something. I don't know, maybe you have the money problems or something. I don't know, something going wrong. But somebody wants to offer you something, a friendship, a job, or sympathy, or something. It's just so weird. Yeah, this is somebody young. They don't want a commitment with you. They just want to... I don't know, maybe they want to, maybe they know what you're going through. Maybe they, I don't know, this could be a friend, an ex, a lover, family member, friend, family, any or whatever. Like somebody know that you got some money. Somebody knows you hiding or something. Like somebody's, I don't know, they're trying to find out something about giving you a gift or being friends. Uh, some shit like that. As it was the uh, page of cups, we got six of wands. So maybe somebody wants to know how you get, like how you get all that money, how you get what you get, how you do what you do. So maybe they want to find out. So the page of cups is the six of wands. So somebody see that you're good at something, that you're successful at something, and they want to know. So they can know. So they can do it. So they can get it too. <laughs> Like, yeah, somebody trying to, like, wonder how you do what you do, how you became so successful, how you get all that money, how you became a popular, famous, or some shit. And they want to get on your side. Maybe they want to know. They want to find out. Maybe they got some tricks up their sleeve. Maybe they want to block you, stop you. Maybe they want to stop you from moving on, moving forward, or some shit. I asked Spirit, what well, was the justice? Gave me seven of swords. So I don't know if somebody's trying to still take something, get away with something, plotting, planning, something. Okay. Then the Nine of Pentacles came out. You could be the Nine of Pentacles. I don't know if you're teasing someone, making someone mad, or trying to make someone jealous, Virgo. But it's like you just saying to yourself, like, I still look good. I still got my money. Um, I'm still, like, it's like you making... It's crazy. This reading is crazy. Yeah, this reading is so crazy. So 
So somebody, I don't know, someone decided to take justice in their own hands, I guess. By taking from you, stealing from you. Or something. And you still come out to be the nine of pentacles. You still come out like somebody having a hard time taking, stealing from you, or getting something. But anyway, Virgo, this is your reading from yesterday. July 21st, July 22nd, July 23rd, 2023. So I hope it go through this time. Smooches.